travelled to NACE in Ireland and we're visiting P&T Precision Engineering, a company who have bought a brand new machine every two years since 2016. It's a real success story, this one. Hi, I'm Dara Walsh from P&T Precision Engineering. Uh, at P&T we specialise in the design and manufacture of components, jigs and fixtures for uh, the food industry, the medical device, the pharma and uh, healthcare industries. And what's important to me is the growth of P&T Precision Engineering. We were a family business and we were a small company with six employees and we decided to invest in CNC equipment from uh, ETG. We ended up buying a, a good few ma new machines off them. It just helped us grow in the industry that we needed to grow in and help our customers get more product on time. So in, in a short space of time we've gone from six people to 22 people. But we've also grown in machines so we're hoping to grow that into the future as well. So p and for me was an up-and-coming family-run business and basically they were going from manual machines to coming into the CNC world. So they approached us and they wanted to make that advance from manuals to CNC. So they approached us there and we sat down and we spoke about the first machining center and then we introduced them to the Quasar MV184. And then from there we then migrated on every two years. They were then buying more technology uh, with the AS200 and then two years again later, they went back to another MV184. So this type of machine is a big step up from where they were. So most of their parts they were doing in manual multiple operations. So with the MV184, they were able to take that part almost from drawing, from CAD straight into the machine and a finished part coming off. So they were able to get the parts through much quicker. And also that takes the downtime from going from operation to operation from a manual process. We went to ETG because they give great support and service. Um, they also have good quality machines, they're great repeatability, um, fantastic quality, durable. We've never had any issue with any kind of machine that, that was not being able to fix within a couple of hours. So buying and investing in our machines and our technology um, it enabled them to move on through different types of components using different types of materials, especially harder materials. Um, this allowed them to get into a market that they wasn't used to and opened up doors and opportunities. And that led them then to looking at the AS200 because that was a whole line of new different products they were able to look at. So the machine behind us has enabled us to manufacture components in a quicker time uh, because of the less setups. So instead of having to take stuff from the lathe to the mill, it can do it all in one shot. So it's decreased our machine time, it's reduced our delivery time, and it also means that we can get more parts through the workshop. Uh, they were making parts in multiple operations from the lathe point of view. Uh, using the AS200, they're able now to put that part complete in one operation. So they're able to do all the milling, drilling, tap it, and also transfer to the second spindle. So the part is now coming off in one complete operation as opposed to multiple operations. So uh, P&T are a very creative company, so very much into their design. They do a lot of design work for their local companies that they work for. And so they came to us and said, look, you know, we've got this kind of work. Are we able to do it on our machines? So we sat down with them, we supported them, we guided them through the different ways that we could approach the jobs, um, different to what they were doing in the past. And that allowed them to actually produce much, much better parts, much quicker, and also to keep the accuracy and the tolerance into the, into the parts that they were making. We, we did the training, so all the, uh, on the hiding hand control was new to them as well. So we guided them through the training process on how the operation of the machine with the control works. Um, and then we do operator training as well, so we're able to come in, set the part up with them, and then basically go through the whole machine aspect. So literally taking them from the, the manual process to a full CNC process. We were able to be there all the way. The future for P&T Precision we hope to uh, break into the 2,000 square foot next door, expand uh, with quality machines, and also expand our workforce to increase our capacity.